What's up, YouTube? Be back with another shoe review of the Jordan Retro 5 Metallic Silver. Uh, release date April 4th, 2015. It's April 5th, 2015. I didn't feel like doing a review yesterday. I'm going to do it today. Y'all already know size 10. Um, wow. Got him from Foot Action. Check out the top of the box here. Why not? Oh, definitely. Voila. Jordan Retro 5 Metallic Silver Colorway. A lot of Mr. Mosins on the shoes from people. I think it's fresh. It's a really nice, pretty much all white shoe. Start. Bottom of the shoe. Outer sole, if you will. In the front, we have a black piece up here. Take it on down. You've got your black jump man. Your white midsection. And a icy blue transparent finish on the outer sole as well. You'll see the word Jordan as well written right there. Real fresh. Take it to the midsole. Start from the back where you have a air unit. Oh, uh, white midsole with um, hints of transparent icy blue, whatever you want to call it. And we have the signature shark teeth on the Retro 5 model. And that's metallic silver. Take it to the upper sole. We have a silver and black 23 with a very, very fresh transparent mesh right here and on the tongue you have lace pods you have a very nice very nice tumbled leather upper sole the whole shoe is mainly tumbled leather that's pretty much what it is take it to the back the heel of the shoe you got your jump man sign and as you can see on the remasters well on all the Jordans they get better and better. They show the um, description, you know what I'm saying? Real defined description of Jordan, you know. Take it to the inner sole. Verbatim, same thing. Got the mesh, shark tooth, icy blue, outer sole, air unit. Now, um, take it to the tongue of the shoe that's a metallic silver right there you can see that glow up in the light metallic's real nice and you on this uh shoe you have a um lace guard as well real nice lace guard and from what i can see on the tongue of the shoe also it, this whole tongue is that mesh material like here on the side some mesh material until you get up to the front of the shoe where the um Metallic silver is in the all black jump man sign. Real fresh, y'all. Y'all leave y'all thoughts about these shoes. I can see why a lot of people will pass, you know, 194 shoe that's really basic in colorway, but I mean, I, this is what I do, man. It's nothing new to me or my girlfriend for that matter. And she decided to pass on these. Um, next week, she's going to end up with the. Uh, Foam posit golds. Um, I actually have a Jimmy Jazz opening in my local area, and they're gonna have a restock on Verde's Sevens, Foam posit gold, Foam posit obsidians. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Uh, a couple of Jordans, the Marvin the Martian Sevens, um, as well. Um, the French Blue Sevens, they're gonna have a restock in. Both pair of the Lady Liberties and the um, Bulls over Broadway. So it's gonna be a busy weekend. Next week at uh, that Jimmy Jazz, I'll be going for the uh, Georgetown 11s. And uh, y'all know for a treat today. Um, I guess I can get the box out of the closet. But uh, these are the Jordan Hydro 13 Retro uh, flip flops, man. I bought these for a pretty little ticket of fifty dollars. Compliments of foot action. You know what I'm saying? Real nice shoe. Um. As any Jordan Retro 13, you got your tumbled leather finishes up on the strap, as well as a suede going across the strap with a red Jumpman logo. And this is like a gel-like material. I don't know exactly what it's called, but that's what it is. And 
You take it to the heel of the shoe, you got Jordan in red letters. So you take out the shoe, of course, you've got your air bubble. I like them, man. They're comfortable. I've been them for about a week now. You know what I'm saying? Velcro strap. Size 10 is what I wear. I also got, uh, got my girlfriend a pair of them too. Size 7. Uh, these were grade schools. No, actually, these were females. They weren't even grade schools. They were in the uh, women's section. Pink jump man on the um, strap. Velcro strap. And hers, this is real soft. This is different than mine. It's not like a gel material. It's more like a soft cotton. It feels really good. Take it to the size and see you've got your pink. This is like a, like a I don't know what exactly this is. It just feels really nice. It's shiny like material. Take it to the back. You've got your pink Jordan label. And up on the top of the strap is these patterns. Yeah, man. Wow. So y'all leave y'all comment, subscribe, like, dislike, whatever you want to do. I'll be back next week with another review. Y'all take it easy.